Jessica, you have nothing to be ashamed of. I know, I'm not ashamed. I'm guilty. I feel guilty and I can't help it. You know, we are so happy and Antonio... Listen. No. I know. And I feel bad about that. I do. I actually do. <laughs> but I don't give a damn about what other people think. And neither should you. I know, I just... I need a break from everything, not, not you. It's still, not I mean, you. it's your condition, and I'm not going to be there. I, I'm going to have hepatitis C for the rest of my life, so I'm going to have to learn to live with it. The rest of your life, but you haven't been at a hospital that long. I promise you, I wouldn't leave if I didn't feel fine. And I got an okay from the doctors. Mine's made up. I'm sorry that I made this decision without you. Yeah, well, hey, you know, I, I come up with stuff in the middle of the night all the time. I guess I'll give you this one. Thank you. Sure. You can owe me one. I promise I will make it up to you the minute I get back. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. I don't think you're going to have to wait that long. Really? You can start with these cases right here if that's not too much. No, no. Thank you, Commissioner, and thank you for letting me back so soon. Yeah, Antonio, um, I don't like to get into personal matters on the job, but... Jessica's your niece. And everything that you did for her, you know, giving her part of your liver and... It didn't take. Not much did with Jessica and me. I know, and I'm sorry about that. Be happy for her. She is. Yeah, but I've been in your shoes and it doesn't feel good. Yeah, well... What are you gonna do? You're gonna get through it. And you will get through it, trust me. Well, we'll find out. No, you will. You're gonna find somebody that's gonna make you happy and somebody that's really right for you. Yes, come in. Sorry to interrupt, but uh, I've got news. Oh, hi, Natalie. Where are you sitting? There's a place right behind me. Plenty of access to my back. Of course, you've already done your damage, haven't you? Can you just stuff it for once and let the man have his day in court? Like he gave me? I am not discussing this with you here. Where would you like to do it? At Vicky's? Maybe during Christmas? It'd be nice. You can bet Circus Boy won't be there, though. He should be rotting in prison by then. Excuse me. Natalie, I told you not I to know come. not to come, I know, but I think I was going to let Todd and Blair have their feast on you without backup. How'd it go out there with the press? No, Howard handled them. Uh, Miles, I need to make a call. Be back. Thank you. Doing okay? I'll have to admit I'm a little nervous. You're going to be fine. Uh, no questions. No qu Get back. Hey. hey. Stokes, can you give us a minute here? Of course, Lieutenant. Thank you. I would take those cuffs off if I could. Hey, really? You know? I guess the press something to write about. Yeah, well, um... They're pretty busy with that other case. What case? Never mind. Miles? Yeah, they, yeah. See if they have enough evidence to go to trial. Uh, yeah, I wish I'd never met Miles Lawrence or Spencer Truman. Uh, I wish you hadn't either.